My name is Mallik Arjun. I am working as an associate professor in the department of HNS and heading the department. And my educational qualifications are MSc, MPhil, and pursuing PhD in Kakati University. Now I am going to be teaching about the concept Karu fitting, the fitting of Karus, constructing of Karus, fitting of Karus. That is called by Karu fitting. What do you mean by fitting of Karu? Fitting of Karu means constructing the constant values and calculating the constant values and constructing the Karu itself is known as fitting of Karus. In mathematics, there are infinite Karus are there, relations are there, but the simplest and important Karu is straight line. That is, y is equals to mx plus c. where y is called dependent variable, x is called independent variable, m comma c are unknown constants. So that calculating the values of c and constructing the line itself is known as fitting of a curve or a curve fitting. So there are so many curves are there. Now we are going to taking one example that is straight line y is equals to a plus bx and the unknown constants are calculating by using a principle called by method of least squares or principle of least squares that is summing and squaring the difference between absurd and expected value is called error. The difference between absurd and expected value. What do you mean by absurd? Absurd is given, expected is calculated and always the principle of least square tries to minimize the difference between absurd and expected value and the difference is called error. Now we are going to differentiating this error with respect to the two unknown constants called A and B and equating to 0 will get two equations and these two equations are called normal equations to the straight line y is equals to a plus bx. Differentiate the error e with respect to the a and equating to 0 we get 2 into summation i is equals to 1 to n yi minus of a plus b into xi. Differentiation of x square is 2x into differentiation of x is 1. That is differentiating y with respect to a is 0. Differentiating minus b xi with respect to a is also 0 and differentiation of minus a with respect to a is minus 1 equals to 0. That implies 2 into minus 1 is minus 2. Transposing to the right hand side, 0 by something becomes 0 and expanding the summation. That is, summation i is equals to 1 to n yi minus of n a minus b into summation i is equal to 1 to n xi is equals to 0. And finally, we are going to transposing the terms which involves the constant values to the right hand side then finally we get summation i is equals to 1 to n yi is equals to n a plus b into summation xi i is equals to 1 to n. This is called one of the normal equation to the straight line y is equals to a plus bx. Then again differentiate the error e with respect to the one more constant called by b equating to 0 will get one more equation that is dou e by dou b is equals to 0 that implies 2 into similarly that it is in the form of x square the differentiation of x square is 2x into differentiation of x again it is a constant similarly summation i is equals to 1 to n 
y i minus of a plus b into x i and differentiation of y i with respect to b 0 differentiation of minus a with respect to b is also 0 differentiation of minus b x i with respect to the b is minus x i is equals to 0. that implies 2 into minus 1 minus 2 again transposing constant to the right hand side 0 by something becomes 0 and expanding the summation meanwhile we are multiplying the term x i with each and every term that is y i into x i x i y i a into x i a x i b into x i b x i square and applying summation that is i is equals to 1 to n x i into y i minus a into summation i is equals to 1 to n x i minus b into summation i is equal to 1 to n x i square is 0. Now, we are transposing the terms of constants these two to the right hand side okay? that is summation i is equal to 1 to n x i y i that is equal to a into summation i is equal to 1 to n x i plus b into summation x i square where i is equal to 1 to n. This is one more normal equation to the state line y is equal to a plus b x. By solving these two equations, we will get the constants. a and b. So, that the calculating of values a and b substituting these values into the line y is equal to a plus bx is called the fitting of a straight line. So, the purpose of the fitting of a straight line is calculating or predicting the future values, but there are infinite variety curves are there exponential, second degree, power, parabola, but in which all the straight line is the simplest and important one. Thank you.